all right so in this video we will look at how to implement a package called ziggy inside our code base so that we can use the route names to link different pages of our application instead of kind of hard coding the urls okay and so do that first things first we will do a composer require of this package okay and these are fine i think this package replaces the add the rates directive with the collection of all your applications routes okay so this i think is something which i need to add somewhere in my code base i think this will be the um, the the view the main view which i am using so inside app.blade why don't we add it here okay so so yeah we did a composer require and i added this at the red routes inside my app.blade.php one thing which i additionally need to do is if you go inside routing of inertia you'll see they tell us to do something like this okay view yes i think this will be somewhere in my app dot js so i'll open up my app dot js um let me see if it works here okay and i hope there is no error in our console right now no there are none am i getting the route uh, let's say it is leads slash list no no i don't so maybe i'll get that inside my view why don't we check that so index dot view inside this okay it's inner shear link href okay and this will be this dot dollar route let's try that uh, lead list right so why don't we name it as lead dot list if we are able to link that without breaking our code and we have some problem see there's some error but it says this is undefined so if that is the case okay it's dollar route so is it like this okay i have a fair build fresh and all right this works that's fine that's good news actually and if i do view and then if i pass lead is lead will that work i have change that and yep i think it is working so if you see though the two urls are now working properly so we need to add just one thing and lead add okay, which is along with this why don't we have inertia link have class button button let's say warning href will be dollar route lead list and the name of the button will be back this is lead add and lead view which means if i oh that's a problem why are we getting such a bad behavior there is a link obviously but 
<laughs> uh, something happened okay I think uh, the placement is wrong it should be here right Cop uh, copy this and add so I have a back and if I do add add has a back as well so basically now what will happen is I can view the data the only thing which is not coming I feel is the package something happened index I think I made a typo yes interested PSC K a G E so that's one and added on let's see yeah so annual plan and annual plan is not visible here inside the view why is that is there one more typo mm. interested package this is fine PSC KG view index what happened seems to be fine okay this is package that's the problem I think so in view should be this and an add as well it should be this which means here I will need to change this and if I am not wrong lead controller what is it expecting inside store it should be this okay now we have made quite a few changes first of all hit refresh okay, this is working first we will check the add some user some at image email okay one two three four five six seven eight nine and one one two thousand nineteen and we will have annual package hit save okay our redirection is wrong right now we will handle that as well quickly but okay annual plan is visible right so let's go to lead controller and on store we are doing a redirect route should be uh, lead list wow there's an autocomplete coming up um, I think it's the update which I have made which is doing that anyways uh, add 2d one more okay one more gmail.com Nine eight seven six five four three two one 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 two thousand nineteen. Okay, that's fine as well. Uh, monthly. Let's say plan. We we will try to do a um, a drop down later on. But right now the form does work. So now everything is working fine. You know I'm redirected to the list view. If I click, I am able to view it. And the next thing which we are going to do is handle the update in our next video so thanks for watching guys if you like the video and the series do click on the thumbs up icon and don't forget to subscribe to my channel